Remember how I said in yesterday's late night Pierre-Luc Dubois update that I hope this trade goes down when I'm awake. Well, I don't know about you, but I don't really know too many people who get up at 8 a.m. PST on a Saturday. Aside from those who legitimately do have work, by the way, but yeah, you know, I set an alarm today. Albeit that alarm is an hour late, but we have ourselves the official trade made. It is Columbus and Winnipeg getting it done. Check out the deal right here. It is Patrick Laine and Jack Roslevic for Pierre-Luc Dubois and a 2022 third round pick. Now, this... In theory, it should not really be super surprising. We already had the word last night that Roslovic and Patrick Laine were up in here in that discussion, and now we have the official confirmation that Pierre-Luc Dubois and a third was enough to get that Patrick Laine roslovic trade done. The Jackets and the Jets were both in unenviable positions with star players who wanted out. From the get-go, Winnipeg and Columbus getting together on this seemed destined, but the Blue Jackets spoke to a pile of of teams before circling back in the end to Winnipeg, like 15 to 20 teams to varying degrees. We then had a few other pieces of news come out about the trade. Roslovic gets a two-year contract extension with a 1.9 AAV, so he gets signed and he's going to be officially playing now. And this is what Pierre-Luc Dubois' agent Pat Brisson says. Pierre-Luc Dubois is excited and he's looking forward to joining the Jets. This could have been a longer process. We're happy it's done. Looking positively ahead. For the flip side, this is what Line's agent Andy Scott says. We spoke to Patrick after he met with the Jets staff. He's very excited about the Columbus Blue Jackets. He's already received texts from his new teammates, and he already spoke with his new coach and GM. We're making plans for him to get to Columbus ASAP to begin his quarantine. And so, yeah, you know, it's kind of funny, and it's kind of cathartic how it ends off this way. Patrick Line and Jack Roslovic over for Pierre-Luc Dubois and a third. Obviously, you had other teams in there. You had other discussion points to go about there. We had so many other teams enter this discussion on both fronts, but now it's officially done, and Pierre-Luc Dubois is going to go over to Winnipeg. In a few years, you're going to have Shifley, Dubois, and Cole Perfetti, some variation of that three-headed monster over there, tearing things down at the center ice position. Then you have yourselves the Columbus side of things where Patrick Laine is going to come over here and hopefully become the number one first line caliber winger that he wanted to be and that he wasn't being over there in Winnipeg. So this is a trade. If we go over to NHL Watchers Twitter account, he had himself a poll where he asks who wins the trade, Columbus or Winnipeg, fair deal for both teams. 822 people have voted at the time of this video's uploading. And it's a very overwhelming majority saying that Columbus won this trade. And it's hard not to say that they did, because Roslovic is a very good, capable NHL forward. Middle six guy for sure, top six debatably who does have a lot more room to grow in this league. Line, we don't know how good Patrick Line is and is going to be. Meanwhile, Dubois and a third is just Dubois and another asset. But again, tell me in the comments what you thought about this trade here. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, Trolls and Nine. Good morning, by the way. It's a really early... And bye.